what would happen if we had this when I was younger. At the time, you know, we didn't have any real established figureheads. There was, uh, you know, there's no mentors, there were no teachers, there were no examples. So for me, I just kind of wanted to be the first. But I didn't realize how lonely of a road it was going to be in trying to break in. If I meet other Filipinos, we're going to find a common ground. And that's the end of being Filipino. And if we're all artists, then we're all on the same page anyway. I've never felt like I had a mentor growing up. When things started getting organized, she asked me, what do I want to do? What do I want to contribute to the seven? It's easy to be on the outside looking in thinking, oh, you know, I can totally do that, or, you know, someday that'll be me. But because of the KPC, I'm actually in it. Capistano works at the foundation to build identity, to foster empowerment, and then Copy Seven is a uh, is a place that allows an opportunity for youth to be free in their expression and in their art, and it's also a place for them to be amongst other Filipinos going through the same struggles they are, and um, also dealing with being an artist in the community. The, the deepest part of any artist or any individual is in their roots. Because of Pakistan, uh, my music has bended in more ways than I can ever imagine. Pakistan is a place that we can engage youth um, through arts and culture um, in a way that uh, strengthens our sense of identity and strengthens our community. I was kind of looking for a place where there would be other Filipinos who were young like myself, just looking for like-minded individuals. Um, that I could share my cultural experience with. And, um, and then I found the KBC. Realizing that that need was being filled by being here, I now know that it's gotta be filled for other people too. And there are people who are gonna be looking for it and we've gotta be around for that. Coming to the K is gonna be hope because it means that there are people out there that are hungry for change. In my lifetime, I think, uh, I think it will change. I think uh, it's, it's already changing now. I feel like people my age actually aren't interested in learning about their culture. And here, I guess, it kind of makes it cool to want to learn about your culture. I don't, I don't know how to really describe it, but I'm kind of proud and excited to see where this goes, thanks to Cup 7. This is the culmination of all of our collective experiences. And so it's really important that we, you know, we use this place wisely because uh, it, it, it's really going to dictate what what the next generation looks like. It's not only just important for us to be here today,